school committees, sporting committees, church committees, and workplace committees. We are all familiar with different committees, but how do committees function and what elements combine to make an effective committee? A committee is a group of people, usually people with a vested interest, brought together to manage, address, or oversee a particular organization, part of an organization, or a particular problem or issue. For a committee to be effective, its role must be clearly defined. The goals and objectives must be understood by all committee members. And it must be able to meet in a timely manner to address problems and issues that arise. Some committees act only in an advisory role, while many actually have authority to make operational or management decisions. Regardless of their power or authority, committees are set up to perform needed functions and can and do make significant contributions to the successful running of many organizations. Safety committees, or health and safety committees, are an important part of many organizations' strategy to deal with the always important issue of workplace safety. Ideally, a safety committee will be made up of people from all different areas of an organization. This will help give the committee different perspectives on the problems and needs of the whole workforce. Representing every part of the organization may not always be practical or possible, but an effort should be made to make the committee as diverse as possible. The safety committee should meet on a regular basis. An agenda should be prepared for each meeting and distributed to each member well in advance of the meeting time. Everyone will then be aware of the issues to be discussed and any necessary preparation can be done. Each meeting should be formally chaired so there is one person directing the discussion and keeping the meeting on topic. Minutes of the meeting should also be taken. Clearly, safety committees have different roles in different organizations. Some are actively involved in safety management, and others act essentially in an advisory capacity. Some of the functions that a safety committee might perform include organization of promotional activities to raise the general level of safety awareness in the workplace, review and or development of safety practices and procedures, investigation into the hazards associated with the introduction of new plant or equipment, investigation into the hazards associated with the introduction of new chemicals or raw materials, review of training and induction programs, gathering facts and statistics to identify problem areas or unusually high rates of specific accidents or incidents, generally addressing health and safety concerns, liaising with safety inspectors, safety representatives, and safety management personnel whenever necessary, and ensuring occupational health and safety regulatory and legal obligations are met. Whatever the responsibilities of a safety committee in any particular workplace, it's important that the extent of these responsibilities is understood by all.